We're out to make a difference in healthcare. We want to detect early disease in a very cost-effective and powerful way. The beauty of, I think, what we do is using the new technologies in a focused manner. So I believe that in about a year we're going to be profiling samples from people so this is a drop of blood and give you an instant readout within an hour or two about the state of your immune system and what your body is responding to. And in terms of disease, whether it's cancer, allergies, vaccine responses, it's potentially a hugely powerful system and we're committed to trying out whatever innovative approaches and take whatever collaborations are necessary to do that. So I think there's a very interesting um, thought now that instead of going, as the NIH might say, from bench to bedside, what you should be doing is what Sidney Branner said, is going from the bedside to the bench. And the kinds of very powerful instruments that Thermo is providing with their mass spectrometers and many other instruments as well, uh, they're an agnostic tool but starting at the uh, bedside piece of this would seem to make a lot of sense and should be increasingly emphasised. We've gone from the stage of, for example, running a sample in a few months that would cost three or four thousand dollars to potentially running a hundred samples a day for a price that's about fifteen hundred fold cheaper. So what this means is that you can begin to do completely new sorts of things. We never thought about doing this before because it was completely out of the question. This is an idea that one would want to measure all the proteins in the body. So why would that be the case? Well, the most persuasive answer is to do with disease. Is in terms of diagnosis and the kind of thing that they do at the brims here, discovery of biomarkers, this is key to understanding disease mechanisms. So the simple concept of trying new ideas out, most of which will fail, is something that we embraced. So one of the things I see about the brims is that it doesn't just provide the tools you can learn about running. So these are very sophisticated instruments. This also has incredibly strong ties with the academic community and is all set up really to foster interactions. Coming to a place like the brims, you can talk and learn from the people that really know the instruments that are set up to collaborate. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the new spirit actually of the very advanced technology. You don't just wait for the people to come with you, to you with an application note. And I don't think uh, finally that there are that many companies doing it at this level.